even comes with the faux plants inside. Brand new for spring 2020. It just debuted last week. It is our only order of the season. Five easy payments of $6.24 first time on those five payments. And this is something that's just going to be that touch of whimsy for the white picket fence, mm -hmm. for that bare space on the wall of the deck or maybe on the side of the shed mm -hmm. that you just want to spruce up without really having to put a lot of work into it. Nancy? I know. Oh, Hi. thanks for having me, mm. Stacey. It's wonderful to see you. We're going to have a couple plow and hearth items, mm -hmm. which is awesome for 30 years now. Um, just the premier company for bringing uh, beauty um, to our outdoor spaces with yes. a nod to nature, always their inspiration. Exactly. You know, Plow and Hearth is that company that's going to give you really unique and fun items to help you jazz up your indoor and outdoor spaces. And they're always coming up with great designs. You love their wall art. So they give a little twist to an umbrella and they <laughs> turned it upside down. And rather than raindrops falling off of the side of it, the raindrops, you know, are not an issue here because we have faux flowers that are all inside each one of these. So you have ever blooming flowers, no matter where you choose to put this. So we have our blue one and notice each one has darling little pink polka dots and the flowers are going to be different colors in each choice. So this was our blue mm -hmm. and then in the center we have our pink that has lavender colored flowers. They're almost like little baby roses. They're just so sweet and pretty. And again, these are faux plants so you don't have to worry about watering them. They're always going to look beautiful. And then, and then to our most limited choice is the orange. And of course, you got to keep it kind of citrus inspired, right? Yeah. With that burst of the orange. Exactly. Petals there. This polka dot is just so stinking adorable. <laughs> it is. If you are a Susan Graver fan for fashion, doesn't this just say fashion for my outdoor space? Oh, it you know absolutely she's, does. She's always, um, she's always into polka dots. So super adorable. Again, first time on five easy payments, six dollars and twenty four cents. So, all right, show me the other details and. Let's talk ideas and where to put them. Exactly, it. exactly. So this is made out of metal, so you don't have to worry about it. Notice the high sheen. I'm going to get this, the, the, the sunlight here in the studio to shine on that. So you can see that this is made to withstand the elements. It's really beautiful. These flowers are all going to be weather resistant. You don't have to worry about those two. It's got the little hook of the umbrella right here, and that's how you're going to hang it. So as you've seen right over here, I'll just show you. All you're going to do is just hang it on whatever hook or nail or screw that that you want. I love it on this picket fence. Mm -hmm. Absolutely adorable. But if you'd like to use it on your house, we have a couple of ideas back here. Oh. We've hung it on the door, the Look windows. At this. You want to walk back there? Yeah. So let's say you have already a nail or a screw back there for when you had your <laughs> Christmas wreaths up there. That's what we did. We just hung it right up here. So you have something dressing up your window during the other years. I mean, the other uh, months of the year. Yep. Just absolutely adorable. And, you know, like you said, your fence line. And maybe even if you want to use it inside, you want to see it now because you're not spending time outside. How about a bathroom? How mm -hmm. about a little girl's room? Mm -hmm. So many different places you can enjoy it. Definitely maybe that door going from um, the outside to the garage. Oh, I or the love back that. door going so out to cute. the patio. It's mm -hmm. just that it just screams that. It's about uh, 16 inches high or 12 inches high, about 16 inches wide. Would you say it's wider than I'd it say is it's, taller? it's taller than it is wide. So, so it's 16 about, inches high, yes. 12 inches wide. Okay. Yes. And about sticks out maybe six inches from the back. Remember, totally flat in the black back, so it lays really, really nice. And and again, it is that wall art that we love from Plow yeah. and Hearth. Something oh. that you don't have to worry about fading in the sun. Mm -hmm. If it gets rained on, it's not gonna rust on you. Right. Yeah, exactly. Great for your she shed if you have something oh. like that. Love the idea of having it on your back fence. Maybe you have a fenced in yard like we used to have in California mm -hmm. and you have your flower bed down below. It's always nice to put something in that space um, along the fence line just above your flowers because that's kind of forgotten space. Absolutely. It's nice to have something really neat and to have some of that vertical decorating to kind of fill, you know, your visual, uh, you know, plane that you're looking at. So this is super easy to do it's really in fact I'll show you how easy it is to put okay. together too really simple and um, I'm gonna turn it around because all you're going to be doing is putting the handle on there's just two screws right here Phillips head screwdriver will do it and you're just gonna attach that and that's it and then you're just gonna figure out where you would like to have your darling little umbrella full of flowers is it is it heavy 
Like oh, I'm going to feel it. I'm going to say, I don't know, oh maybe my gosh. a pound, maybe? Or I'd say little, two pounds Maybe tops. two, yeah. Yeah, maybe yeah. two pounds. It's not very heavy, so it's going to be fine Aww. no matter where you're going to Look put it. Look at that. Look at those it's polka so dots, cute. right? And again, you don't have to worry about what you're going to put inside because the faux florals come with it. The purple mm -hmm. and the pink combination is just absolutely delightful. So girly girl. I actually like seeing all three colors. So if you I do, do have to fill out a wider space um, with the easy pay, that we have right now, pick up more than one, get all three or get at least two colors, two of the different colors. Cause right. I think it's just, just like your garden would be, you know, you're not always gonna be planting the same color of right. flowers, of blooms, especially, you know, in your sun patients, you want varying colors. So I'm even saying with your wall out, vary the color. Exactly, and I like doing things kind of in an asymmetrical way. So let's say you have two. I'm kind of holding this one up a little bit higher and let me grab the other one there. You got so it. So that you can, if you do all three, you can kind of do a grouping. Mm. So you can kind of have it balanced like this or you can have one a little bit lower. You know, just play with them because you have all those vibrant colors and the flowers and you don't have to water them. So put these somewhere where you don't want to have to worry about watering because guess what? You don't have to. Absolutely, so blue, orange, orange and the pink, 16 inches tall, 12 inches wide, our only order of the season. First day on five easy payments of $6.24. Nancy is going to be back with what Plow and Hearth is best known for. Mm -hmm. Their very first item they brought to QVC, the spinner, 